Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. It's day three. Wow. I mean, straight away I'm I'm tired. It's about half past seven in the morning. The uh the little Bengal cat kept me kept me up. Kept me kept me in bed, that's for sure. I wanted to stay in bed cuddling it, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Anyway, moving forward. We got legs, we still need to hit the gym. We're gonna do it this morning. It's better to do it early, get it out the way. That's how I see it. Just get it done, get it dusted, get it out of the way. Here we fucking go. This is it, it's a big day. It's a big day. We had a trade open, 150 pips, buys, running in profit with a 20 pip a sell. So it's around 7.5%, which is good. And that was just in platinum and free trading group. So make sure to join the link in the description. But first things first, let's get to the gym. Actually feed all the animals first. Brush my teeth, get to the gym, get the leg session in, get a stepper cardio session in, and also abs plus sauna as well. And then coffee, then day start. Content needs to be made. And yeah, I'm just gonna start making some sort of like course videos. Every trader take, record it with analysis, then put it in a group for people to learn. Oh, <clears throat> right. I've done all the tasks I need to do. I am absolutely knackered. I don't even know why, because, you know, there'll be days where I go to gym three days in a row, easily, no doubt about it. But today, today feels different. Maybe it's because I know that, you know, I've got a, a, a big day in tasks, but what I'm going to tell myself is, you know, I may be tired. The cold plunge would probably help me with my recovery. So I'm just aching everywhere. But this is expected, you know, having a gym in a minute, it's just, it's, it's all about recovery. It's all about recovery now. So moving forward, I'm going to try and get a cold plunge. However, the day stays the same, you know, we'll get a leg session in, try and push ourselves low on food. Have definitely a protein shake after the sauna and then I'll get a coffee. Adjust the situation. Uh, probably would just have eggs, you know, like three, four eggs, high in protein and then figure out what I'm going to have moving forward but tired like anything in life and it doesn't matter where you are you're only human so you're gonna get tired with this sort of stuff but we go again we get it moving in the end of the day i'd rather be doing this than a lot of other things so fucking hell it's not even that hard get over it it's the mental battle of tiredness oh, update trade on ftmo we're on about Damn, five we're on about five six k in balance wise holding the trade out we're currently down one percent so let's see what happens there the copyright is at break even now after yesterday we had a terrible disaster so now basically i said to people if you're doing like 50 dollars, which is what i was doing we're going to try and escalate it to as much profit as we can but as the markets moved heavy we was in the run trade boom so we managed to you know keep the deposit on the account and that was just one percent every single trade we're not trying to do two three five percent per trade and hold out the trade xyz i'm just going to take it real slow and i'll update you on the, these buys because i've called them out in the free trade and platinum and hopefully we hold them overnight so hopefully it smashes take profit for 250 pips. coffee secured haven't in the gym yet it's just gone over half past eight i'm gonna get myself in there get a big session in but i thought i need this for today hopefully build up the momentum i've uh, got a guy's ftmo 25k on at the moment just started so i'll keep you guys updated with that my ftmo 100k is up four or five percent still and another guy's phase two he's doing a 200k one that is at break even so i'll keep you guys updated show you screenshots obviously when they all get passed if you do need that service link is down below in the description tjfx box click that slash start open it up and get involved but yeah let's go smash out this leg session now and get the cardio and sauna done another day another done we're back There it is. We're back in the stomping ground. <sighs> Come on, it's only a little bitch. It's only the third day. Still got 72 more after this. Fuck. Slow my way down when you do this. Control the weight. No one likes leg day, but you've got a lot to to love what you hate doing it's not looking good bruv first exercising and i'm on the shitter oh fucking hell 
battling demons. Clothes are about to come off right now, I'm telling you that. Let's get back into it. Obviously you can do all the L's or hamstrings, but or you can just sit here with your head back, just doing the hamstrings. You've got to squeeze as well, so you come up slowly, squeeze, come back. Oh, it's all about controlling that weight. Come on. Doing the calves now. I don't know if you can see. Oh, this one's, if anyone's done any of these, these are absolute. Oh, bonus. Fucking hell. Get your legs up in the air. Fuck me. It's my first leg session in such a long time. So I'm just trying to get my muscles loose, get into the swing of things. So. Oh, leg session done. I feel sick, honestly. From this morning till now. Didn't want to get it done, got it done. Now we're on the step off. After this, we've got abs and then sauna. So slowly but surely ticking it off. Just started. I'm only doing 10 speed today. I need to keep in mind that it's a marathon, not sprint this. I already feel fucked. I'm hoping once the cold plunge is in, we start to recover better, but also once my muscles start to get used to this sort of side of training every day, I should be able to come around. If not, then maybe one of my cardio sessions might have to be a walk, you know, so my legs can recover so I can start running again and that sort of stuff. But yeah, for the time being, I'll update you when I'm on this, but I'm already out of breath. I nearly fainted earlier, Jesus Christ. <sighs> it's always a mission to improve. It's always hard. It's easy to be fucking in your comfort zone in it uh, to do the easy thing you know cook dinner or get a dominoes get a fucking dominoes every single time stay at home watch football go to the pub watch football play snooker got every time pub and snooker or pool with a couple beers 10 beers down trickling in at two in the morning that's what i'm trying to avoid but yeah we're all on this journey now together so if you're watching this Hopefully it tries to motivate you, but I ain't no fucking miracle worker. Saying to Oscar, the editor, I don't even know if I'm going to be able to do 75 days, but I'm not going to feed that to myself. I'm going to continue mentally battling these demons, get the job done, get fit, get in shape, and just completely change my lifestyle. Two more minutes. Ah, abs and sauna and then job done. What you gotta do is walk, <sighs> live stream, make content. Come on, bruv, how much do you want it? Turn it up. Come on. 15 seconds left. Fucking turn it up again. Stop, stop. I'm not gonna fall. Oh, 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 fuck off. Oh, that's unbelievable. Oh. Coming in. You gotta do these, even if you can't do many. It's basically, when you go to cut, at least you're in a good starting point. And relax. Oh, 25 minutes. Currently at 69 degrees right now, if you can see. 69 degrees. Oi, oi. Uh, fucking hell, we're so mature. Jesus Christ, the fact is, half of you just laughed out loud, which is even fucking sad. I hope none of you want to train, but yeah now this is it and then get the day done it's always hard at the start anyway with anything if that's business if that's you know gym if that's work you've got to build the fucking pool you can't just be zero to 100 you've got to put the work in every single day and that's what we're doing and you're going to see me shred weight you're going to see me just do more throughout the day be more happier during the day be able to be active you know once I'd start doing all these sort of stuff with the walks, with the gym, with the sauna, with the cold plunge, the times two cardio, all that sort of stuff, 
it would just benefit me long run i'll get used to it muscles will get used to it and i'll be able to do more as well just at the start because you're a slob i'm a slob it's difficult but job done gold buyers still running in profit too <sighs> after this protein shake i need to clean out the fucking cold plunge today and go to my other house collect a tv to put up in my new house so i'm gonna do that as well oh <sighs> fucking hell the sauna's fucking up my skin man got a spot on my nose got shit oh now protein shake time so again it's with water get about 20 plus grams 30 grams in it so it's a good little substitute for protein as soon as you finish your workout you should technically be having two of these a day or two scoops a day at least minimum but yeah gonna have a protein shake i think for food i'm gonna have half a pack of rice with two tins of tuna uh, just because tuna actually hasn't got much protein in so you need two lots a lot of people only have one lot and then they're not even getting the right protein for their muscles to stay and they just end up burning the muscle away so that's a top tip I believe that's true anyway. If that's false, then there's no surprise. It's, it's come from me. But yeah, gonna quickly make a protein shake and then we'll get moving. I've got to walk the dog and then I might oh, skag him for a drink. I don't, I've got a drinking issue, I think. Skag him for a bit of wine, you know what I mean? It's just nice to, when, I feel like when, when you do good things, it, it just makes you like, it's, hold on. Just feel like when you do good things, for me personally, I'm like, a, I'm like a sabotager with like doing, being successful with like, if I do gym, I'm like, right now I can have a beer. Or if I do well at work, I'm like, right, I've done well this week. I can spend more money. I don't know if anyone else is like that, but that's what I'm starting to, starting to understand. I saw someone talking about it and I was like, fuck, that, that's what's wrong with me, right? But anyway, let me just make this. Good session, I've got it done, feeling good. If I hit that cold plunge, we'll be feeling like high right now because it gives you a massive rush. But I feel chilled out. I feel like, well, I've fucking completed it, basically. I've done two sessions in one because I'm a boss. Now it's time to just fucking make money, innit? Let's go. What a day. What a day. I fasted for 17 hours. Hit the sessions. Now on the protein shakes, all liquid. So this basically doesn't even count. Half a pack of rice. Gonna try two tins of tuna just because you don't really get, as I said, enough protein. And then walk the dog. And then that's my steps as well. So it's not very uh, nice day today where I live, but we're still holding gold. We're still gonna get the job done. And it's currently just gone past 11 in the morning. So we're winning. We're definitely winning today. Today is our day. We're taking over. Day three. After today, another 72 days. Fucking hell. You boys are with me on the journey. Hopefully, this motivates some of you to get going. Start trying it as well. Maybe not 75 hard, but just a few sessions extra a week than what you're doing now. What the fuck is in here? You've got gammon and shit in there, Paige. Smells absolutely unreal though. Fuck it. I want some of that. I'm starving. Here we go. Right. Oh, there she is. There's one. Right, let me just put some on there for you. Oi, oi, oi. Have some respect. Bless him, he's just eating it out there. Oh my God, what the fuck is going on? Move out the way. So we have got two tins of tuna, half a pack of rice, mayonnaise. Paige, can you pass me the pepper and salt, please? And then yeah, I've got to try and eat this all, basically. Uh, it's boring to eat. I've just had a protein shake as well. What a day. I've just actually come off the charts. I know Oscar can show you this, but gold is absolutely flying. I, I caught buyers yesterday after hitting a few take pro, uh, few SLs, sorry. 
I've also called it in the free trading group. Let me just show you. We're aiming for a top week and then it's, we're aiming for a top week and then it's gonna sell off, okay? To 25, 50, then 25, 25, and then it's gonna go back up to the next highs. So we're currently holding on multiple FTMOs now. I've got a few people's prop firms on MT5, MT4. I've got about three on the go, including mine. And also this is on the copier too, so. You can check out the copy of results, link in the description. You can join the platinum link in the description, join the free trade link in the description. Everything's in the description. You've got to click on the TJFX spot. <sighs> but now I'm gonna go for a walk, get my steps in outside. It's currently 20 to 12, the day's still young. We've got high impact news at 2 p.m. And I'm gonna start, I'm gonna stream it as well. So if you wanna join my live streams, either on YouTube or Twitch, make sure to follow me up and yeah, you'll be there. We're gonna get people on on a Discord, which is also in the description, so join up. And then I'm gonna invite them in, talk about the trade and their views and all this sort of stuff. So it's gonna be very, very educational and it's free of charge. It's a windy one. The windy one today. I don't know why I feel really, I feel really tired. I'm drained, I'm exhausted. I've only done about two or 3,000 steps so far today. I need to try and get 10 to 15. 15k but yeah. so i'm gonna walk around the whole entire field right now i'm gonna do dog walking later i just want to get your steps in then stream uh the live news at 2 p.m and then it's basically job done for the day really but i can't lie boys i'm craving to fucking go pub play some pool and that but it's only the third day in hopefully that I don't think that's ever going to wear off, but let's see. Let's see. Ah. Ooh. Hopefully you could hear all that. But feeling good, nevertheless. I'm still fat, though. Obviously, it's not going to happen yet, but it should do. Still holding the buys, of course. It was only just a couple minutes ago. And I just hope everyone's enjoying these, because we've still got another 72 days after today to go. Come on. I currently just got off a call with one of my mentorship group people, one-to-one -one call on gold. I showed him a full trading breakdown and how to basically read the charts, read gold, where, where's it going to, why is it pushed up, when's it gonna sell off, the reasons for this, the, you know, the technical terms of analysis as well. So that was successful. I've also just put that link of the recording which was 18 minutes into the free trading group you can go watch it and uh, basically you got a free session if you want to watch it i suggest watching it if you like trading and want to get better at trading gold any advice is good advice should we say the least plus i know what i'm doing so just makes sense um still holding gold too we we're just yeah we're just holding um at the same place as well i'll put it in the group 2563 was the entry. We're at 2577. We're at 2581. We're waiting for wick sales at 2590 area. Hopefully, we get that and it doesn't sell off here. If it does sell off, then it is what it is. But it's a 250 pip trade, which is going to be nuts because that's a 12.5% trade from just 1% risk. 12, 12.5 R to R, which is good for us and we need the profits. So Fingers crossed on that. The time is now half past one. We've got FOMC news, which is high impact news for the US. Out, I believe it was 2 p.m., but I need to actually double check what is going on with that news. So give me a second. I'm gonna check it now whilst I stay on with you guys. You should always check news every single day. If you're not checking news, you're not a real trader. If you're wanting to trade as well, then you must be checking news. If you trade and you don't check news, then there is a slight issue with yourself half one shit six minutes fucking hell here we go half one and then uh at 7 p.m fomc so we've got high impact news in six minutes and then at seven o'clock at night for uk time we have another high impact news which is fomc and that's gonna go nuts so fingers crossed we pull some money out of the bag today because every single day we've been profitable which is lovely Okay, still holding gold buys, but it's not looking good. So the copy are probably down down a bit. I've just checked it and obviously gold's selling off, which is annoying. I'm trying to walk the dog at the same time. Get the steps in. I hit about 7,000 steps so far. Um, 
old so he's trying to get a couple more thousand in see all i've got to do is get 10k so not too bad Air's a mess the trade's a mess but holding at break even so if sl goes to 28 63 then it'll just close out with no loss which is fine nearly 100 platinum members as well so thank you everyone that's joined up we're like 15 off so i appreciate all the love that you're showing me and yeah it's been a good day i've did a one-to-one -one session with someone taught him everything i'll put the link in the free trade so if you want to go watch it it's an 18 minute recording with him talking in it as well go check it out hopefully you guys can learn how i look at the charts and try and put that into your own perspective and your own strategy and hopefully you can start learning quite easier because it's not a it's not a race it's not a it's not hard to trade it just takes time all right i just called a platinum sale look at this oh my god peanut butter raspberries honey but yeah anyway um yeah new buyers called it so let's see what happens with that this is just a little snack update i'm on 9,000 steps as well today i'm just chilling right now but i'm gonna go get some more steps in very very shortly after i eat this the plus 10k could try and get 12 15k steps all right i don't know if i told you boys and girls but secured two percent on buys on platinum and this is the food i got homemade pie mash and some vegetables where i don't really eat the vegetables the mash is just a teeny bit of carbs and i know the pie ain't really the best nutritional thing to have but there is there is meat in it and also you can use this day as like a refuel day as i've done legs and cardio about to do another walk after this which is gonna get me to around fifteen thousand steps all i had for lunch was two tins of tuna and half pack of rice so i'm doing well so far so this is going to be a nice little reboost meal to take on tomorrow come on time is currently half six fomc starts in 30 minutes so waiting for that just closed my buys out right now closing for 2587 it was which is a good buy and now i'm going to jump into sales i'm getting sales all the way down to 25 good luck me here we go believe in it fo mc there it goes on a one minute 2588 i'm still in the trade as well come on believe 2587 this is on the one min time frame come on keep dropping we need to see it go to at least 2565 come on big drop here big drop here big drop 2585 holy shit it's going can it go even more this is gonna be huge. We just secured 12. 2584 just dropped. Oh my God, it's going. 2583, big sales. 2582, we're running plus 4%. Makes up for that buy that just hit SL. That's good. Already secured our profits there. Holy shit, it's going. 2590, perfect entry, mate. Perfect entry. Yes, what a trade. What a trade. Honestly, look at this. Let me show you. This is my this is my chart. This was a high. One, two, three. We sold off. We respected the previous lows of, of the highs. The higher low was respected. Broke out the zone. So we're gonna need a liquidity grab here, which if you look to the right is 2530. And the previous bullish engulfing on the retest of the body was at 2520 and the high in two five three five which is where we're heading now that previous high is easy 250 which is why i'm targeting it because that's where i believe that we're gonna head at minimum 2550 which is 400 pips now if we even if we look at this zone here one two three sells this was a one two retest on the previous lows it retested broke below so now it's coming up to wick all the previous sellers out and then and uh, that's exactly what it's doing right now ah oh, that trade hit sl unfortunately it's annoying but nevertheless we made a lot of money today in the free trades and also platinum gonna see how it reacts overnight in tokyo and try and get in on the sales during london open so make sure you guys are in the group Thank you for the support, like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. What a day.